steam curing at ordinary pressure steam curing at ordinary pressure is generally adopted for prefabricated concrete elements the application of steam curing in construction site will be a little difficult task however Steam curing at site is done by forming a steam jacket with the help of tarpaulin or thick polyethylene sheets. But it is found to be inefficient in sight. Steam curing at ordinary pressure is done on prefabricated elements stored in a chamber. The chamber should be big enough to hold a day's production. The door is closed and steam is applied either continuously or intermittently. The accelerated hydration takes place at the higher temperature and the concrete products attain the 28 days strength of normal concrete in about 3 days. In large prefabricated factories, they have tunnel curing arrangements. The tunnel of sufficient dimensions are maintained at a different temperature. The concrete products are mounted on trolleys move at a very slow speed subjecting the concrete products progressively to the required temperature. The trolleys are kept stationary for a while and finally pulled out of a tunnel. The influence of curing temperature on strength of concrete is shown on the graph. Steam curing is commonly adopted for precast elements, especially pre-stressed concrete sleepers. For rapid development of strength, some special type of cement is being used. The girders used in bridges are being cured by this process. A typical steam curing cycle at ordinary pressure is shown on the screen. It consists of various durations and temperature given for different period. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. The best is yet to come. Kindly do like, share, comment your views and finally don't forget to subscribe our channel.